Hello lovelies, welcome once again to my channel. This is Marcel's Kitchen. I hope you are all doing well. It's nice to have you all here. Today, I'm sharing with you my chicken curry recipe. This is so delicious and it doesn't take too much time to make. So please, let's get busy. You are proud to be part of Masab's Kitchen. You are proud to be part of Masab's Kitchen. It's very educative, very informative. Nothing delays, always the best. You proud to be part of Masab's Kitchen. You proud to be part of Masab's Kitchen. I have my potatoes, chicken thighs, my beans, my masala, my tomato puree, red onions, ginger, anise seed, I have turmeric powder, black pepper, and some garlic. So in a pot, I'll add in my red onions, give it a stir and let this cook for about 3 minutes. I'll now add in my garlic, then stir it up. It's now soft so I'll go ahead and add in my chicken thighs I've already cleaned and sliced it up I'll add in my ginger my anise seed black pepper turmeric powder my masala you can use curry it's the same family give it a nice stir I'm not adding any water at this time. I'll just leave it to steam and it will develop its own liquid and cover it up. After 10 minutes, you can see that it's cooking well. I did not add any water. I then add in my tomato puree. Then stir it up nicely. At this stage, my kitchen is smelling really, really good. I'll cover it. Just look at it for another 10 minutes. You can see our chicken is cooked very well. I'll now go ahead and add in my potatoes. I have nicely cleaned and sliced up. You can also cook the potatoes in a separate pan, but I decided to add it. It's simple. I'll add in some water to help cook the potatoes. salt stir it nicely and then cover it up if today is your first time stopping by a warmly welcome to you do not hesitate to subscribe to my channel and also hit on the red button so that anytime I upload a video you'll be first to know and to my old subscribers thank you so much I really appreciate you Added one bay leaf in this sauce. It's doing well. It's been cooking now for about 20 minutes now. I'm gonna go ahead and add my beans to this yumminess. Mazab's kitchen. Stir it nicely. 
This is so simple to make and it tastes so so delicious. So after 10 minutes, just look at this. We are not going to overcook our beans and it's looking good. It tastes so so delicious. Just look at this. Amazing. Please do not forget to share this recipe with your family and friends. I will list all the ingredients in the description box below. I will be pairing this delicious chicken curry with potatoes with my roti. I will link my roti recipe in the description box below. Please don't forget to check it out. Until I come your way next time with another delicious recipe. Bye for now. Smack like eight.